Welcome back, everyone, Hearts of Iron 4, using the, the No Step Back DLC. I'm your host, Mr. Russia Lover. But right now, got some comments to go through. And right now, apparently, we're at war with the Coalition of Free Commonwealth States. I don't exactly remember what happened, how we came to war with them, but we're beating the crap out of them. Um, yeah, I think I went to war with Luxembourg. And then, yeah, I did go to war with Luxembourg. And then they called in, or they were invited to join their faction. And then, I guess the rest is really history. We've just been kind of just... Literally driving on in to uh, France, so yeah. Overall, not too bad. Kind of weird that we're at war with them, but oh well. Which means we got to be ready for the war against the British Communist Alternative in Iberia. Um, we do need to go to war with the Turks as well because we can get our, our ships out of there too. But we're working on it already, and they'll get rid of the Greeks, the Poles, you know, all the normal good stuff. Also, talents. Oh, we got the Paris done, and improved railway networks. We did as well. So if you're ready to do that, please go right ahead as well. Very nice. Um, Adaptable Army, Guangxi Independent Republic is gone. Now, I don't remember which ones I've read before for this campaign. I can't honestly remember at all. I got a problem. But a new beginning. It also takes some time before the disruptions of war have been fully made good, but by setting the right goals, we can already gain some productivity gains. Pretty much, man. Pretty much. Which we're doing very well with invading France. Quite well, I'd say. Quite well. Actually, after this one, what do we want to do? Anything else down here? Yes. Alright, we do want... Uh, Slavic commitments are not bad. Pan-Slavic nationalism... Yeah, let's do that one immediately next after this one. But Russia has long been the biggest and oldest brother in our Slavic family. If there's one lesson that we should have learned a long time ago was that the Slavs will always be attacked, bullied, or oppressed unless we stick together. Very nice. Very nice. And go and cut them off if we can. Just kind of ride up the coast. Get a get a, what we love is breast. And Italians, well, the Italians are still doing Italian stuff, so. Uh, we know a lot of divisions here. Um, I forgot that they had uh, access to here, so. My bad. But it's alright. And uh, all big. What the? That's kind of dangerous, railway guns. Oh, do we have any extra railway guns? Oh, yeah, we do have that. Nice. Uh, give, them, give the motorized a bunch of railway guns. That, that sounds like a lot of fun. Nice. Marse oh, you're just leaving Marseille. Okay, then. Um, there you go. All right. They're gone. As we can invade in Pakistan, apparently. Not great. But oh well. See if you guys can come down here, maybe. Invade Italy, because that would be really good if we could. I'm hoping Sloan invades um, South Africa, because they're considered a major, and I don't want to deal with these guys forever. Uh, we got to deal with these guys as well. Actually, Turkey is guaranteed by anybody here, or what? Who is Turkey guaranteed by? The Republicans, Italy. Oh, yeah, so that would be okay. Nothing armor, nothing that about the armor schemes. Very cool. Heavy ships, subs. Ooh, motorized. Not bad. Let's grab some of that, too. Two, two. See if we can use some of these guys on some of our uh, divisions. Cruise that by five ish. Heavy ship hulls, cruiser hulls. 1944 cruiser hulls, of course. Um, we only have 30 army XP, which is not very much, honestly. Even though I do want to get some of these guys out immediately as fast as humanly possible. Um, level twos are fine. Level two to three is pretty decent ish as well. Uh, it's just not great. And then five, and we get anything for four. Anything for four? No, five. That sucks. Um, five? Why is everything five? Why is everything five? That sucks. Eh, it's not a really good ship. I don't know if we'll actually be able to make it, but whatever. Uh, if that's the case, let's see. Go on in if you can. Go on in if you can. See how much damage you can wreck. Oh, there, where are they? Uh, do we have ciphers done too? Oh, we have some ciphers done. All right, not bad, not bad. Um, just keep going in, or, or, or just just go in, I guess, technically. And you guys are all around China because they're part of the Allies there, so, or Allies, you know, the British Communist Alternative, which would be good to kill off over there. Um, we're gonna have well, that's gonna be kind of a struggle against Poland too. Um, what we might do is just figure out the Polish situation first, address the Polish question. That's a lot of divisions. Yeah, we need a lot more divisions. Hmm. Uh, they're doing okay -ish over here too, so. We'll see. Because we need one army for Greece, basically. We shouldn't take too long. I just want the Turks under us too, so we can get those ships out of there, but we'll see. Um, it's kind of hard to tell between our green and their green. There's a little bit of a difference, but not a huge difference. Keep getting, using those railway guns. Uh, oh, 
Wait, what? They go to war on the Japanese Shogunate. Wait, what? Oh, why do they go to war with those guys? Well then. We're going to go to war a lot faster than I thought we would. That's a lot faster. That's really not good. That's actually extremely not good. You guys keep doing what you're doing. You're doing a fine job. If you guys could take out these guys here, that'd be phenomenal as well. And you 24 guys, ah, we're still stuck down there too. Okay, that's not good. Because how are we supposed to fight these guys too then? Hopefully our allies can come in and do some stuff over here. Let's go, Germany. Let's go, Austria-Hungary. I need you. Was not expecting that immediately. Holy crap. Go in and kill them all off. Burma. Uh. Sure. Honestly, if we can get kill off China faster, that'd be good. Let's go to war with China. Please. Wrap those guys up. Hopefully our allies can help us kill these guys over here, too. Um, uh, guys. Participates in all the wars available currently. Oh, we're not at war with these guys. Okay, that's good. Um, okay. Ooh. We'll see you soon. Who our real allies are. I have lose a few divisions here and there, then so be it. You know, it is it is what it is, but... Yeah, it's not great. Not bad. Let the infantry continue doing what they're doing down here. They're doing more than fine. They got a lot of divisions stuck around there. And looking pretty good here. Nice. Oh, watch out. We gotta fight Trinidad and Tobago now. Tobago? Tobago? They don't have that many divisions here either, which is good, too. And let's take Gibraltar if we can. Oh, we lost the railway again. God dang it. They're over here, too. God dang it. Keep going in, guys. And Austrians. Austrian Soviets. What? Uh. Okay. Good luck with that. Doing okay over there. Not doing okay over here. Um. Just in case, get one of those guys, maybe. Something like that, maybe. There you go, maybe. Something like that, I don't know. Something not too difficult for us. Not too challenging. We're done with all that stuff. No, we're not, actually, huh? Keep building, keep building, keep building. Keep doing the best you can. Ah. Just hold. Wait till supply gets better, really. It's probably promoted. Not bad. Uh, the tanks are doing the best they can. They're pretty much sacrificial lambs right now. Um, yeah. If we could... We're fighting free France. Oh, it's not good. Real not good. Aluminum, Montenegro, please. Oh, they, they were our puppet, but still. There we go. If the motorized could hurry up, that'd be great. Come on, let us go to war with China. Come on. Come on. Come on. Why can't we just fight? Oh, we have another question back. God dang it. How do we cancel this? Deputy 5, December. If I move my soldiers, we know oh, we already know that they're gonna move around. So the best thing we can do is just kill them off here in, in Iberia, finish them off in France, then go to Greece, finish off the Italians, and then start working our way through here ish. Ish. And get the polls done. Actually, we need to order them. We have an honor Christian back, so that's why. Yeah. These guys are motorized. Oh, Bursa. Good. I prefer to throw on some motorized rocket artillery. More trucks. We wouldn't have enough of that stuff, so. A new beginning. Well, we better do this before the cancels. Um. Honestly, we do want Iraq as well. So we'll see. Event light tanks, not bad. Uh, radio, advanced radio is always good. Special modules, way to ammo storage, special modules. Uh, squeeze board adapter. More piercing is not terrible, too. Get up to 55 is pretty good. Special modules, armored skirts. Stabilizer. Um, uh, secondary turrets. Does lower, actually, that makes us faster. Heavy machine gun. Does lower reliability, though, which I don't really like. Go with armored skirts, that'd be good. 
And you guys, gasoline. Here, do this one, diesel engines. Cast armor. We have more than enough army XP for the cell. Track suspension. Torsion bar. It just slows down a little bit more, but gives it more reliability. So then we can go like this. Oh, we already maxed it out. Well, that sucks. Now let's go back then. Wheel suspension. Oh boy. Hmm. Honestly, that might be a bit too much reliability. There you go. Go like that then. That's fine. Improved. There you go. Try that. Try, try, try. Uh, that's fine, Qatar. Don't really care too much about you. Not gonna lie. Um, who's this army? Oh, like no one here. Got a lot of naval bombers. A lot of casts. Oh yeah. There you go. Sierra Leone's gone. We got lots of planes. Now they're throwing a lot more planes too. There you go. That should definitely help us out quite a bit more. They have a lot of planes as well. They're losing a lot of planes, though, which is good to see. Alright, we've got to finish off Italy as well. And see, no bombs are not bad, but. It's time for some gas. There we go. A little better. We're doing a lot better here than I thought we would. There we go. Now we're definitely winning here. Are we struggling over here as well? Yeah, we are. Um, grab you guys. Oh my god, scout planes. I hate scout planes. There you go. Do that. Get rid of some of these planes. They're just so annoying to have. Look at all this crap. We don't need all this stuff. CVs. Cass. Anything less than 100, I'm just going to get rid of. There's no point keeping it. It's just annoying to see, and I don't want to deal with it. Wait, who's justifying on us? Oh, well, they already are at war with us, so that's not a really big deal, so. Oh, we're doing a lot better down here in Italy. Not perfect, but better. Oh my gosh, so much better. Yeah, that's a lot better. Zukov's doing pretty good. Yeah, we're doing relatively okay in Spain as well. How many, how many of uh, the UK we cut off? 151,000 we've lost. How many of them? 71,000? Makes sense. How are we doing this well down here? Just don't understand. Still hanging out here? Is it any better yet, or is it still pretty bad? It's pretty bad, huh? Just trying to build up roads. Sucks. Monitoring chassis? 19. Good, good. Oh, it's not even connected. Why is it not connected? That makes no sense. Yeah, have some heavy ship holes. Uh, torpedo stuff, maybe. You're going in, and we're almost done with this stuff, which is nice. Oh, that's actually really good to get the subs. I'm glad we're getting this one, too, because sub, the subs are out right now are very good as well. Uh, there you go, too. Costs so much to make these things. There's not very good subs. I'm not going to use them yet. I might never use them. Oh god, not this part. I hate this part. Can I just grind through here? Not good. Oh, well, that's good. That's something we like. Force it. There we go. That's good to see that. That's good. Break over, break over. Come on, you can do this. You got this. Don't get stopped. Don't get stopped. They're just French. Come on, go, 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 go. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, we got over. Okay. Woo! 
We did break over. Thank goodness. Like over here too. And they're not really doing too much over there, which is very nice. Well, we lost that justification on them. Which sucks, but whatever. Can someone seriously invade South Africa, please? Come on. They're very annoying. Come on, close off Gibraltar. Good. Very good. Alright, how's the fleet like? Not bad. Grab some of that. Honestly, you guys can just come over here. Good. We'll see what the uh, polls say about that. And members of 1905, you want to read this one again, please go right ahead as well. Not bad. To Gibraltar, my friends. Gibraltar. Hey! Bulgaria accepts. We've just received a word from the Bulgarian government. Bulgaria has accepted our invitation of membership into the, of the Pan-Slavic Union. A wise decision. And Poland rejects them. Representatives from the Polish government have informed us that they categorically reject any possibility of a voluntary participation in Pan-Slavic Union. The Pan-Slavic Union will be reality with or without their consent. Who needs consent? Consent is a tool of the patriarchy? Mm, I don't know about that. Oh, they all they have was three divisions. Oh, that sucks. Um, you know, we have equipment for that, so we, you can actually use that. That's fine. Oh. Nice. We have no divisions over here, but... Oh, do you guys actually... Oh my gosh, you actually did fully went over here. Um, I'd love to do that right now, but we gotta come over here, too. Oh, we're almost down here, too. Oh, that's so nice. It's all coming together. It's all coming together, everyone. Yeah, go in there. Kill them all off. That's what they wanted. They want to go to war with us. They all die then. You know, it just works. As these guys are doing D-Days against us. Crap. Well, that's not good. A devastating loss for us all. Oh, Estonia. Let's say no for now. Guitar's up here, huh? We do some Danish Straits as well. See what you find? Maybe the Eastern Mediterranean? Oh, Mediterranean. Uh, North Sea? <laughs> Some air bases, because we have four. Not bad. Not bad. And then what? Got some casts. Do we have any fighters left? Oh, yes, we do, big boys. Oh, look at that. We got find a lot of stuff over here. Very nice. Find them in sync. Oh, ten. ten. Oh, there's a lot of Irish around here. Very good. And with these infantry divisions down here, too, now that definitely helps us out. And some of the motorized over there, too. I really want the motorized to do very well. Why? Why are you in the water? Huh? Ah. You're going to stress me out putting them in the water, man. Or we'll go from this side. That might make a little bit more sense. Divisions. Uh, we want to make sure that we can actually just go ahead and just go to war with them and cancel the non-aggression pact. God, the fighting sucks down here. It sucks so much down here. Oh my god, China. China, please. You're literally costing us time. Cancel the non-aggression pact. Oh, soon. Actually, we've got five days left, right? Yeah, I was like a week. Ten days. My guy's getting a lot of kills around here. I love it. You guys keep it up. He's really going to attack. Skill level 3. Nice. Ironside. Superior Tactician. Fleet Protector. Ooh, that reminds me. Um, I always forget about this stuff. So then, kind of stuff. Are we done yet? Oh, no, we're done with it. Nice. Good job, guys. Over here. Alright. So we did all this up already. Oh, that's good. Good. Oh, look at that. British convoys, too. Oh, that's a lot of convoys there. Nice. We lost a couple things, but whatever. Um, why can't we make any more ships? If anything, I want you to all come here. St. Petersburg. They're making ships that just take forever to make.
I wish Buff was going to rebel. German Empire. Oh. Yep, not on my watch. Yeah, no. Nuki Nuki. And then grab some of that too. That convoys are gone. Lots of more convoys. Keep sinking them all. Oh, Russian anti-Japanese propaganda. Russian newspapers have been seen printing uh, increased numbers of articles critical of the Russian exploits in the Far East, and their politicians are using uh, increasingly inflammatory language, denouncing us and reminding uh, the Russian, uh, Russian of the indignant loss of the war in 1905. Already the most vocal agitators are calling to avenge Tsushima, who do well to prepare for war with their old ad adversary. Well, we did beat them. We already have them as a puppet, so I, I mean, we're, we're kind of okay, guys. Sink Young non aggression pact. Yeah, we're good. Nice. It's not like a huge major victory, but nice. Last couple of planes, that's fine. How are we doing against Poland? Oh, I didn't tell you guys to do go. Go in. Yeah, go straight on in. Okay, I already lost one of them off. How dare they exist? Uh, okay, this one fired again. Alright then. Uh, workers and militias, we're good. And oh, we can oh, integrate them. Oh, that's so nice. Russia has long been the biggest and oldest brother in the Slavic family. There's one lesson that we should learn a long time ago. That's oh, the same thing. Yeah. And we can do Slavia, Pan Slavic Union? Industrial sabotage and Vichy. If you don't know about that, please go ahead. Czechoslovakia. That's full control. Integrate Poland. Yugoslavia. Well, I might have to use the consequence because I don't really care about doing too much of this stuff, but like. Are you my puppets or allies? You're our puppet and your buff. Okay, so they're both our puppets. You know what? Screw it. We're going to just cut down in their town a whole, whole bunch. Ooh, that's really nice what we did there. And police. It's fine, whatever. Who cares? There's, look at all the mines here. Holy crap. They'll know. Did we actually, oh my gosh. Why did you stop? You literally don't have orders to stop, but you stop. Why? It's fine. It's fine. Just ask questions. will be all okay. Keep going in. You're doing great. You just need Warsaw, probably. Actually, how much are we importing from... I, I don't mind, like, uh... Doing a little bit at a time towards each different types of nation here. Like, just do all the Germans and then do all the uh, Austro-Hungarians. Eh, at least suffer some damage, whatever. No one cares. What's their autonomy like right now? Oh, what's going down? What's going up? 69? 669? What's going up? Let's go back down. Yeah, we're building a lot in Germany. My goodness, we are just killing a lot of things here. Lots of convoys. Love it. Hey, level 5 on attack. Alright, after members of 1905. The Lonely Island, the Times Comforts reduced or addressed the affront with which the Japanese penetrated upon us in 1905. This time there should be nothing stopping us from ruling the Sea of Japan and bring them to their knees. Oh, okay, everybody did that. Oh, yeah, Poland's gone. Calvinists. Nice. Federal logistics as well. Good stuff. Their engineers. Nice. Fall of Warsaw. Onward, comrades. Onwards, onwards. On onwards, onwards. Hmm. <laughs> You just go in, bros. I love this. Just keep thinking everything they got, man. Um, this communist state, a lot of manpower, lots of convoys. Oh god. Uh, they're doing okay on divisions. Uh, still got a pretty huge fleet of Reno. Tons of planes. And I gotta remember we got a lot of this too. Heavy ship pull. I mean, that's nice and all, but getting subs out right now is probably the most important thing. You go sub fours, you won't go wrong. Um, I want you to actually deploy it right there. 
keep working on some more uh, naval bases for us because we need them immediately. Not bad. And then what? More German stuff? Of course! How laggy can we make it with all these railroads? Oh, that's our territory. Um, hmm. Well. There you go. Something like that. Not bad. Not bad. Uh, I'm not sure how, gonna get, how fast you can get to Mosul, because I don't take a Latvia, but whatever. Because then we can go over here and just start spraying through Africa as well. So that'd be nice. Um, you guys are okay. You guys are okay. Yeah, there you go. You got a promotion, Zukov. Congrats, you got a promotion. Why don't you guys out of here? Right here. Nice. Good. More than that attack, thank you. Good boy. Landing craft, good. Because we're definitely going to need that. And more sub stuff. Um, maybe that one stuff too. Oh, three more at the same time. Well, wow, that's nice. That's pretty good. Level six on attack. Not bad. Fleet protector. This goes no skills though. Actually, where are the subs? Well, all the subs come back here. We can start raiding now. <clears throat> well, these guys did make it, which is pretty impressive. Can these guys win immediately? Well, let's hope so. And then we'll just find the troops. It's fine. Should do okay here. Ish. Hopefully. Um, you guys are doing a lot better than I thought you would already. Motorize. You get more recon. Oh, same template name, huh? No, it same name doesn't exist. Kalariskia Divizia? Well, it goes Kuwait. Goodbye, Kuwait. I'm not sure what they're talking about, but okay, whatever. We won't do it then. And I'm not getting spare troops in this campaign either, so. That's fine. This is one of the most disappointing things I've seen so far. Oh, 60 days, that's fine. Let's go in. Whenever we can. Uh, two more railway guns? You keep losing your railway, gu railway guns, god dang it. Why? Do you hate me or something? Oh, oh, Iraq, oh, Iraq just says I just don't want to live. Okay. All right, and. And we definitely get some of these torpedo stuff. Oh my gosh, we need them so badly. Keeps looking at everything they got. It makes us nice and happy. Of course, we're not making that big of a dent in their ships, but every single thing we can kill, the easier it will be for us. Why do they put the railway guns in the water? I don't understand. Oh. oh, you guys were all the way on the other side of the world. Wow, that sucks. Are you stupid? <clears throat> yeah, you, you literally are stupid. You're repairing. You got more than enough of that. There. Oh, look at that. Yes. Yes. Keep doing it to the Germans. Alright, so after the Lonely Island, then what? Because it's pretty laggy here. And if I'm in the Pacific, as our emperor begins to stretch across the Pacific, so too must our ship design fall suit to be able to exercise our power and influence across the, these vast oceans. Oh, can all seas in Great Asia. Oh, yes, please. Yes, 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 yes. Who dares wins? Ooh. Oh, I'll see destroyers. Nice. Lots of convoys. Tons of convoys and destroyers. I like all the baiting of them. 
Love it when I can bait them. There you go. I was gonna kill them off too. I mean, you literally just might as well. Oh, we need way more rubber. Holy crap! Oh, we caught Bulgaria. Okay, that really affected things here. We're all sturdy. Yeah, I don't want to do that one. That sucks. Um, you know, I'll get another thing of uh, oh, mechanized. I guess we might as well. You know, we really don't have the rubber for it, but whatever. It's fine. Whatever. Uh, go to the exports. That should help us out quite a bit. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Not bad though. Really not bad at all. Oh my gosh, this no, this is bad. This is bad. Oh, there's Lafayette, that's good. I don't understand how they're not suffering attrition down here, though. Good, good so far. Hmm, take that one. Take that one. It was aluminum, yes. Let's see, who cares about having civvies? Just do all these things. Thank you. Or influences, recruitment, no one cares. Back here, working on the Germans just a little bit at all times. Kurdistan, eh, it's fine, whatever. Do the best you can right now. They're not taking enough, they're not taking nearly enough attrition. If you have 30 divisions down there, almost. Hey, Jordan's gone too, that's good. Sub's gone, good. Please don't lose the capital. Whew. That was Carlos. Let's get more destroyers sunk. Ah, here we go. Subs. Alright, subs. You get do your thing right here. Palestine's gone too. That's good, 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 good. You too. There you go. Should definitely help you out a little bit. Hopefully, our guy can become a sea wolf eventually, if not already. Yeah, he's not a sea wolf yet. Firefighting drills, not bad. Get some more firefighting drills. Good, go to war, China. Oh boy, here we go. A lot of green. It's gonna turn a little bit of red, but that's fine. Happens, happens, happens. Um, what is this? Germany? No, we're good. We are good, Germany. This ain't not that shay. But it's just easier just to build in their territory, honestly. Much easier to build. So you should be becoming a sea wolf soon, too. Advanced heavy batteries are nice. Um, make sure you're doing this electric torpedoes as well. Um, no, we're good, guys. We're good. <laughs> we don't need it. Lost an early sub. Ooh, we lost. Sinking a lot of convoys. It's mostly due to planes, but whatever. Just the goal is out to outproduce them. So you guys are fine over there. You guys need to actually kill these guys off. That'd be nice. You guys are hanging out. And you're feeling probably actually okay-ish. Not completely terrible, but you're stuck. So, which does suck. And you got four divisions over here. I'll probably see you side. You guys into here with those other groups. It's totally fine. Whatever. Um, yeah. Independent Switzerland? I think not. You guys are still definitely struggling down here a lot. Level 6 attacker, though. Supply just suck.
What if he just left? There's too many divisions around here. Ooh. I mean, these were early subs. I'm not too worried about that. That's not bad. Uh, more bombs wouldn't be bad either. Are you guys done? Thank God. Okay. See what you can do about these guys. That's fine. Good. And then you guys are good too. Nice. Come on. Become Sea Wolf. Empire and Pacific is good. Then, I would finish up this page here with Iron Wall of Russian Resolve. If you want to read this again, please go right ahead. Because we can. Are we pushing in yet? No. We just kind of left the area, for the most part. Do we just have one division per tile? Yes, we do, which means they're going to attack us like crazy when we can go to war with them. And we should probably double check how China's doing as well. Ah, yeah, we're doing pretty well. Pretty darn well in China. Looking pretty swanky for us. I'd like to go to a uh, close, close economy, but we can't quite do that. Oh. All right, then. 293 ships, exactly. So we can see exactly how many ships they have. Not bad. How many combos do they have? Too many. I really don't want to send anyone down here, because that would be really bad for us. So, the goal is now, just floating harbors, but, uh, tons of subs. And when I say tons of subs, I mean, I'm, I'm speaking, like, tons. A gargantuan amount of subs. Keep building up in Germany, because we need them to be annexed, but... Nope. All it is is going to take some time. And a lot of dead Chinese. Uh, go there. That's fine, yeah. We'll go here, doesn't matter. Let them attack, let them wail against us. Dude's been wounded, that's fine. Come on, dude. Oh. Nice. Um, I'm also the type of guy who just is like, wants to set up for Gep, so... When we do do something here, which one's this one? Ta Russian t Russia Task Force Five. Russia Task Force Five. Russia Task Force Five. Hmm. Nope. Good. Oh, this side's completely open too. It sucks. Okay. I think we caught on to that. I mean, one of the comments was uh, for us to, like, get Saudi Arabia under us as well. We could try that, yeah. We'll see, though. No guarantees. Ooh, we lost two more subs. That sucks. Ooh, another carry, though. Um, as much as I want more stuff there. Oh. They all join their own little lines, huh? Which honestly is fine with me. Just leave us out of that and we'll be okay. You leave us alone, we'll leave you alone. We'll be fine. Get some war bonds. It's war sport, but no one cares. I just want to see if this guy's going to become a sea wolf or not. He is. Good. Anti sub. Why would we be anti sub specialist? Naval speed's okay. Uh, we want to go with screen penetration and then this one. Because as much as I love hit chance in Silent Hunter, um, I just want to be able to just, just chuck subs like crazy. And once you can like pierce enemy screens, oh my goodness, you can just delete enemy sizes. That's so nice. We have another carrier here too. Oh, actually, that's not that's too many carriers in one single group. That's five. Oh, that's four, three. Now four, and there. I do Ireland as well. Not bad, not bad. Mm. Make sure we still go to war with these guys as well. Because they're going to attack us immediately here, probably. If not, then I'm going to attack them right back. 
or does attack him, period? You guys can have that many. Let's see what we can do. Maybe we'll do okay, maybe we won't do okay. You never know. Um, you guys have four railway guns, which is nice. Separate fire mains are not bad either. Uh, cast. We could definitely use more cast. Fighter wise, could definitely use more fighters. Never mind, we have like 10,000 fighters, so. Just because you can have them. The fire mains are nice. Good. And we, we already broke over, which is awesome. Um, honestly, I don't, I don't, I don't want that much more infantry. Oh, now we're doing some more damage. I love it. All the small little upgrades really helps pays off. Cause we gotta starve the beast. Two thousand, huh? That's two thousand too many. Oh, that's a case. Come over here too. We we got a lot of fires, right? Here, use this. Actually, might need slightly more fuel. There you go, because they have ships here too. And Turkey's dying. Yay! Yeah, they, they just stack two hours down there. Uh, cool. So I think I'm going to do a lot more of this off screen, just because to invade the UK kind of really sucks. Um, so all this stuff is pretty much done down here. Lessons of War. Uh, I've already read these ones before, so if you want to read this one, please go right ahead. We'll just go and do that one anyways. Looks like they're trying to naval invade us. Um, we've only got military organization, as well as an adaptable army, and peanut battalions. Please go right ahead. Um, anyone else have the development of Tinklegrad? Our country stretches over vast distances, which makes it impractical to ship sub-components from factory to factory. We should set integrated tank factories vertically. Steel goes in one end, and finished tanks come out the other end. Merch tank and material plants. The tanks and artillery are probably one of the best suited for mass production, making use of econ economy of scale. We should therefore force the consolidation of tank and material producers to capitalize on this. If you want to about the... Well, actually, I'll read this one too. With the Navy becoming more modern and capable, it's time to recognize it as a combat arm that is equal to the Army in importance. The first step is to allow the Navy to form an administration separate from the Army. Surface well-being. Production cost goes down for destroyers and subs. Uh, probably sub warfare because I love subs right now. Subs offer significant advantages in naval combat. A well designed modern sub is practically undetectable before it fires its torpedoes, potentially crippling a capital ship many times its size and cost. We should focus on developing these vessels as the main offensive power of our Navy. Alright, everyone, so it's March 12th, 1947, and as you can tell, we've uh, invaded the uh, Union of Britain. We've done really, 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 really flipping well. We've lost quite a few guys against them, but we've killed off 1.7 of them ourselves. 1.7 million, I should say. We've killed off China pretty easily. Um, there goes Qatar. Goodbye, Qatar. Um, South Africa, India, so has to die, but I don't really care about that too much. Um, other than that, I mean, we've got off a lot of ships. Just a good battleship, too. Um, also, I did annex Germany. As you can tell, there's a lot of green here. Well, maybe not so much, but here's the Air Force. Oh, we've put a lot of planes in there. They got 2,700 fighters, 1,300 casts. They got quite a few ships left. We literally just sunk their last carrier, though. They have five capital ships. Well, I guess nine, 14, but I don't really count heavy cruisers as too much of capital ships, but. But yeah, when I annex Germany. Because this looks really green now, which looks great. Oh, they're like, we won! Um, yeah, we'll just pretty much annex everybody here. Um, yeah. Overall, not bad. Not bad. Um, what I, when I annex Germany, I got their entire navy, which is great. I love owning their entire navy. Uh, we gotta unite the monarchies. International monarchist group. China. Uh, I guess we could pop with China, probably, actually. You know what, let's pop with them. Ireland doesn't have a king. We'll take them. Jordan technically does have a king, so we'll pop with them. Jamaica, I don't think, has a king. Qatar. Gambia, they might actually do, but I don't really care. Don't care. Trinidad and Tobago. Guyana. Very cool. Republic of Indonesia. Um, They honestly probably... I don't know if they do or not, but so we'll just pop with both these. Malaysia, I can't tell if Malaysia does. Republic of Sudan, they probably do, but oh well. Uh, Burma, oh well. Colombia, thank you. Latvia, thank you. Austria definitely does not. Uh, po Poland? Yes. And Unibrim, of course, will pop it as well. Even though, with these guys... Uh, but I think that... Venezuela. Yes, please. Uh, oh, yeah. oh, yeah, we gave him all this stuff before, too. That's right. So, I'll just take it. We'll take it. You know, enjoy ourselves. Um, other than that, is that all? Oh, yeah, we do that, too. Oh, so I am. Even though we can pop it them, but whatever. 
Anyone else? Anyone that we're really missing here that we really... Oh, yeah, Greece. Greece doesn't believe in monarchies, right? Right? Um, El Salvador, Yugoslavia. Oh, there you go. Yugoslavia. Oh, yeah, there you go. What else do they have? Wales, Scotland, People's Republic of... Oh, Hellas. Oh. Almost forgot about that one. Ireland doesn't believe in kings too, right? Well, we killed them off, which is pretty good. A big old peace conference here. Hopefully the game will run quite a bit more smoothly now. But yeah, overall, not too bad. I mean, our navy was sinking and destroying things like crazy here, which was awesome, 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 awesome. Um, where is this? We've killed off 30... Oh my goodness, that's a lot of uh, dead ships. Oh, we're still fighting those guys, aren't we? Yeah, I don't. I just don't care about invading uh, South Africa. I'm sorry. Just don't, I don't really care. I'm still fighting India too, but you know, whatever. We must have made so much infantry equipment that uh, we're now at the counter in game where you, we're negatives. Yeah, look at that. It's pretty bad. We're making 1500 a day anyway, so. It's alright. It's alright. I, 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 I can't be bothered. I don't care. But we're still doing sub warfare. Other than that, we're trying to lower the autonomy here of. Um, Austria Hungary, but just so we can do some of this stuff, declare the Plan Slavic Union. At this point, I don't really care. I just want to see what it's like. I've already done basically everything that we need to for this campaign. So let's do. Uh, honestly, we're just going to annex things. What is this? TDE bug? Annex Hun? Oh, Hungary. That makes sense. Uh, so, and just give us PB. I, I, I don't care. Integrate Czechoslovakia. Oh, or how about we just do decision. No checks. Oh, we should just annex Poland then. Oh, my bad. Annex poll. Integrate these guys. Go do that. Yugoslavia. Annex Yug. Annex Sir. Annex. Is it Montenegro? Who's Montenegro? Annex Mount. I probably just read the consequence, but I just don't care. Nice. 90 days. It's fine. Whatever. Um, and then declare the plan Slavic Union. Cool. Oh, there we go. Oh, yeah, yeah, let's get rid of TDE bug. Oh, that one too. My apologies for using the consequence, but that's actually really nice. Pan Slavic Union. So, what's the event like? Oh, look at that flag. Fall of Rome. Oh, well, whatever. Rome, the Eternal Sea has fallen, of course, but having once again assumed the mantle of the defender of all Slavs, Russia said the best way to do that is to include all Slavic people into a single nation. With that unification at last accomplished, Vladimir III has now announced the formation of the Pan Slavic Union, vowing that all resources available to the new nation will be brought to bear to benefit its people and protect from outside threats. Not bad, but that's pretty much going to end here for me. I just, I don't know. By the end of this, I'm just kind of tired of the campaign a little bit. Just a little bit, just because we've been going for a while. It's 1947. We're kind of dragging on just a little bit, but hey, not bad. It's very interesting seeing the, the Tsarist route for this, but eventually we will end up doing the fastest route in time. But hey, if you enjoyed the campaign, leave a like. Subscribe if you are new as we take a look at some of these leaders that we have put into place. Look at this, Ibrahim. Uh, so we also got uh, check out my Discord link in the description below as well. Um, we also have uh, Arabia here as well, and then who's saying UK? Horatio Dundas. Um, I think that's it. But yeah, thanks for watching, and have a great, 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 great rest of your day.